Hey guys, how you doing? Let me shut off these air fans so it's not too loud. Uh, just leaving from having coffee with my mom and sisters. No, I did not have caffeine. I had some, I did probably a little bit of caffeine because it was, I, I started drinking like decaf mushroom coffee. It's supposed to give you energy, but it doesn't have, it's got a little bit of caffeine, but not much. So um, I brought that with me. So it was nice uh, having a little visit with them, even though we had a big family get together over the weekend. But yeah, so I'm heading home right now because I'm picking up Ted's vehicle that is filled with stuff to the brim to take to Goodwill that from the garage sale. So I had gotten it all organized and packed in this car. I just hadn't had the time to take it to the Goodwill yet. So I'm going to go do that real quick and then go maybe check the kids' books real fast and then get home because at noon I get my grandson. I get my grandson full days um, all the way through Thursday, maybe even Friday morning. So I'm excited about that. Um, the reason why I'm excited about that, you guys, is I ended up getting offered a position in finance and I start a week from today. So I start next Tuesday. So this weekend, Ted and I are doing a little mini vacation to go see my girlfriend, Sarah, over at the Snake and with Sarah channel. I'm looking forward to that. And then we'll head back and then I will start my new job on Tuesday. It is full time, but um, I talked to my boss and he's like, he's always open to flexibility in my schedule, he said. So that's awesome, just in case, you know, Kayla needs me or my grandson needs me. They're very like open to work with me. Um, I kind of was like, like I almost didn't get hired because I'm really overqualified for this job. So I had to really talk to him and say, listen, I am, I just am not ready to retire and I want to go to work. So, um, yeah, but he ended up, I think he really appreciates me coming on board, my boss, and he's like, we'll take what you can get and we will adjust if we need to adjust. So that made me feel really confident going into it. I'm excited about this job because it's like the first time that I'm not calling the shots. Like all of my past career, I've always been, um, you know, senior management and upper level management and it's very stressful. I was never like, I never was not at work. Like even on vacations, I was still taking phone calls and putting out fires. So this is going to be really different for me to be in a career where I actually clock in, clock out, and no, don't need to think about my job at all. So I'm excited about it. It's just, you know, you go in and push some papers, do some data entries, make some reports, and boom. So I'm kind of excited about that. So we'll see what happens. Um, and um, go from there. I'll keep you updated. So I don't know how much content I'm going to be making, you guys, just because, you know, kind of changing it up. And, you know, I know when I first started doing this, I was working a lot and stuff too, and I was able to do content and that. So I'll try to keep up on the content, but uh, I just, maybe, get, sometimes I don't know, like, I don't know whether to keep doing the channel. I don't know if, um, I'm even helping anymore like sometimes I think there's enough content in my first year or two you know talking about my journey you know first year was weight loss journey focused and then second year more fitness journey focused and I'm not too sure that my content is very helpful these days if that makes sense so I sometimes think about maybe um, not making content anymore I don't know so gonna pray about it if you guys can pray for about it to decide that you know I never really uh, got on YouTube to you know make money or or you know get a big following or anything it was really about sharing my journey just in case it would help somebody my age or going through what I was going through and it also kept me accountable so it just I don't know I'm in kind of a weird place on you know being a content creator because I just feel like there's not much new content like that I can create if that makes sense so yeah but that's what's going on with me you guys just wanted to give you um a heads up on what is going on in my life and that so all right I will talk to you later bye